Hey YouTube, welcome to TCTN. I am in 100% troll mode because I wanted to show you something. I have been hearing about the makeup eraser cloths. I do have Marcella water that I use with cotton rounds. However, I still have to go in with the makeup remover wipe to remove my eyeliner from my upper lash line to get the eyeliner off of my um, my waterline. And so I'm like, how I don't if. I don't know how people are using this to get off all of their eye makeup. So someone please like right below how they do that because I'm not able to do that. And so I end up going in with a makeup remover wipe to get off the eyeliner off my inner rims, to get off the eyeliner from my upper lash line. And so I'm like, what is the point if I'm going to use a wipe anyway? This does take off my eyeshadow and my mask and my mascara really nicely but other than that I'm still have to use the wipe and so I kept hearing about the makeup remover cloths and I said okay let me try them um, I had purchased two different sets off of Amazon there was a set that was like a smoke gray and I think it was five in this set and I purchased them because of the size and I already sent them back um, it did not even remove my eye makeup. And I know they, they both said, well, both sets, that set and this set, said to wash them first. And so I did that. And then to just saturate it with water and wipe off your makeup. The other set did not even take off my eye makeup. And I will go on to Amazon and find it and post a picture of the one that I returned. And I'll also post a picture of this set here because I don't remember what the names of them are. Or I'll just put the links below. So this set, it came in four, and I purchased them again. The reviews were okay. I purchased them because they were long, and I'm like, okay, this is nice. The other ones that I returned, I think, were maybe about this size. And so I used this one today. I saturated it, and then I used it. The more, it says, the more saturated with water, the better. And so I kept going back in and just wetting a small part and getting off my makeup. It took off my eyeliner up top, it took off my mascara, it took off all of my eyeshadow, it took off the liner off of my upper and lower waterline. So I'm like, this is really great, it's amazing, it's awesome, yes. However, <laughs> it was not long after that, that my under eyes became really sensitive. And I was like, oh no. <laughs> So I did my second cleansing, I washed my face, and I actually washed it twice because my, like this area, and even now, it is still so sensitive. My eyes are still tearing. It is just horrible. <laughs> and it's like really, it's just really irritated and it's painful to touch. Like this area here, it's, it's not good. And so I washed my face twice and then I put on my eye serum, my eye cream, and I was looking at my face and it's more red than it was before. And so this is what I wanted to show you. And yes, I'm getting all up in your face and I don't have a zoom, but like this was not here before. These marks were not here before. Like all of this redness, that was not there. These bumps on my forehead, these were not there. This redness under this eye and over in the corner, like right here, that was not there before. This eye is even worse. From here, and this this eye is more tender than this side, but this whole area, look at that. Like all of this redness and irritation, and I was not rubbing hard, but there's something in, in this that my skin is like, no, we're not. This redness here, these bumps, I haven't been out in a few days, and so it's not from wearing a mask. This has been red under here. This is more red. I'm just like, but this is what really disturbs me <laughs> because it's painful to touch. And so hopefully it'll clear up in a couple days. And so <laughs> I did go on Amazon and I put in for a return and it said to not even send them back. I forget where they were shipped from. I guess because it costs more to send it than the product cost. And these were, I'll put the link below because I don't remember what they were. Neither set was expensive, um, but I was so excited to think I can get away from makeup remover wipes. 
I did not receive a confirmation email saying not to return it. On Amazon, it said, you do not need to return this product. We will refund you to your method of payment. And so I'm going to wait until I know for sure that they are not expecting me to return it. And then I will find these three that I did not use a happy home. And so stay tuned <laughs> for that giveaway video for these. And it will not be titled a giveaway video. It'll be something about makeup remover um, cloths or something like that. And so these are the three colors. Um, I don't know yet if all three will go to one person or not um, because you can use one side one day let it air dry use the other side the next day and then wash it so I'm not sure yet how I'm gonna do that um, I feel like a robot because I say it in a lot of my makeup videos and skincare videos my skin is very sensitive and very temperamental and like this And I mean, it, this is not good. It, it's not good. And so I'm going to go. I just wanted to share that tidbit and to show you why I'm a troll right now. Because <laughs> I wanted you to see. So stay tuned, subscribe, and click the notification bell. And I will keep you updated on the unused <laughs> makeup remover cloths. And that's it for this video. Thanks for watching.